Pope Innocent X, Latin, Innocentius X, the 6th of May 1574 to the 7th of January 1655, born Giovanni Battista Pamphilge or Pamphili, was pope from the 15th of September 1644 to his death in 1655. Born in Rome of a family from Gubbio in Umbria who had come to Rome during the pontificate of Pope Innocent IX, Pamphili was trained as a lawyer and graduated from the Collegio Romano. He followed a conventional cursus honorum, following his uncle Girolamo Pamphili as auditor of the Rota, and like him, attaining the position of cardinal priest of Santusibio, in 1629. Before becoming pope, Pamphili served as a papal diplomat to Naples, France, and Spain. Pamphili succeeded Pope Urban VIII on 15 September 1644 as Pope Innocent X, after a contentious papal conclave that featured a rivalry between French and Spanish factions. Innocent X was one of the most politically shrewd pontiffs of the era, greatly increasing the temporal power of the Holy See. Major political events in which he was involved included the English Civil War, conflicts with French church officials over financial fraud issues, and hostilities with the Duchy of Parma related to the First War of Castro. In terms of theological events, Innocent X issued a papal bull condemning the beliefs of Jansenism. Biography <inaudible> 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 Early life Giovanni Battista Pamphili was born in Rome on 5 May 1574, the son of Camillo Pamphili, of the Roman Pamphili family. The family, originally from Gubbio, was directly descended from Pope Alexander VI. In 1594 he graduated from the Collegio Romano and followed a conventional path through the ranks of the Catholic Church. He served as a consistorial lawyer in 1601, and in 1604 succeeded his uncle, Cardinal Girolamo Pamphili, as auditor of the Roman Rota, the ecclesiastical appellate tribunal. He was also a canonist of the Sacred Apostolic Penitentiary, a second tribunal. In 1623, Pope Gregory XV sent him as apostolic nuncio ecclesiastical diplomat to the court of the Kingdom of Naples. In 1625 Popo Urban VIII sent him to accompany his nephew, Francesco Barberini, whom he had accredited as nuncio, first to France and then Spain. In January 1626, Pamphili was appointed titular Latin Patriarch of Antioch, in reward for his labours. In May 1626 Giovanni Battista was made nuncio to the court of Philip IV of Spain. The position led to a lifelong association with the Spaniards which was of great use during the papal conclave of 1644. He was created cardinal in Pector in 1627 and published in 1629. Papacy Election the 1644 conclave for the election of a successor to Pope Urban VIII was long and contentious, lasting from 9 August to 15 September. A large French faction led by Urban VIII's nephews objected to the Spanish candidate, as an enemy of Cardinal Mazarin, who guided French policy. They put up their own candidate, Giulio Cesare Sacchetti, but could not establish enough support for him and agreed to Cardinal Pamphili as an acceptable compromise, though he had served as legate to Spain. Mazarin, bearing the French veto of Pamphili, arrived too late, and the election was accomplished. Topic: <inaudible> Relations with France. Topic: Pamphili chose to be called Innocent X, and soon after his accession, he initiated legal action against the Barberini for misappropriation of public funds. The brothers Francesco Barberini, Antonio Barberini and Taddeo Barberini fled to Paris, where they found a powerful protector in Cardinal Mazarin. Innocent X confiscated their property, and on 19 February 1646, issued a papal bull decreeing that all cardinals who might leave the papal states for six months without express papal permission would be deprived of their benefices and eventually of their cardinalate itself. The French Parliament declared the papal ordinance void in France, but Innocent X did not yield until Mazarin prepared to send troops to Italy. 
Henceforth the papal policy towards France became more friendly, and somewhat later the Barberini were rehabilitated when the son of Taddeo Barberini, Mafio Barberini, married Olympia Giustiniani, a niece of Innocent X. In 1653, Innocent X, with the cum occasion papal bull, condemned five propositions of Jansenius. S. Augustinus, inspired by St. Augustine, as heretical and close to Lutheranism. This led to the formulary controversy, Blaise Pascal's writing of the Lettre Provincialis, and finally to the raising of the Jansenist convent of Port Royal and the subsequent dissolving of its community. <laughs> Relations with Parma the death of Pope Urban VIII is said to have been hastened by his chagrin at the result of the First War of Castro, a war he had undertaken against Odordo Farnese, the Duke of Parma. Hostilities between the papacy and the Duchy of Parma resumed in 1649, and forces loyal to Pope Innocent X destroyed the city of Castro on 2 September 1649. Innocent X objected to the conclusion of the Peace of Westphalia, which his nuncio, Fabio Chiga, protested in vain. In 1650 Innocent X issued the brief Zello Domus Dei against the Peace of Westphalia, and backdated it to 1648 in order to preserve potential claims for confiscated land and property. The protests were ignored by the European powers. <laughs> <laughs> English Civil War during the Civil War 1642 in England and Ireland, Innocent X strongly supported the independent Confederate Ireland, over the objections of Mazarin and the former English Queen and at that time Queen Mother, Henrietta Maria, exiled in Paris. The Pope sent Giovanni Battista Rinuccini, Archbishop of Ferma, as a special nuncio to Ireland. He arrived at Kilkenny with a large quantity of arms including £20,000 of gunpowder, and a very large sum of money. Rinuccini hoped he could discourage the Confederates from allying with Charles I and the Royalists in the English Civil War and instead encourage them towards the foundation of an independent Catholic-ruled Ireland. At Kilkenny, Rinuccini was received with great honours, asserting in his Latin declaration that the object of his mission was to sustain the king but, above all, to rescue from pains and penalties the Catholic people of Ireland in securing the free and public exercise of the Catholic religion, and the restoration of the churches and church property. In the end, Oliver Cromwell restored Ireland to the parliamentarian side and Rinuccini returned to Rome in 1649, after four fruitless years. <inaudible> Olympia Maidalkini <inaudible> Olympia Maidalkini was married to Innocent X's late brother, and was believed to be his mistress because of her influence over him in matters of promotion and politics. This state of affairs was alluded to in the Encyclopædia Britannica 9th edition 1880. Throughout his reign the influence exercised over him by Maidalkini, his deceased brother's wife, was very great, and such as to give rise to gross scandal, for which, however, there appears to have been no adequate ground. The avarice of his female counsellor gave to his reign a tone of oppression and sordid greed which probably it would not otherwise have shown, for personally he was not without noble and reforming impulses." The relationship between Maidalkini and Innocent X, both before and during his papacy, is the main concern of the book Mistress of the Vatican by Eleanor Herman, published in 2008. <laughs> Death and legacy. Topic. During the papacy of Pope Urban VIII, the future Innocent X was the Pope's most significant rival among the College of Cardinals. Antonio Barberini, the Urban VIII's brother, was a cardinal who had begun his career with the Capuchin brothers. About 1635, at the height of the Thirty Years' War in Germany, in which the papacy was intricately involved, Cardinal Antonio commissioned Guido Reni painting of the Archangel Michael, trampling Satan, who bears the recognizable features of Innocent X. This bold political artwork still hangs in a side chapel of the Capuchin Friars' Church of the Conception Santa Maria della Concezione in Rome. A legend related to the painting is that the dashing and high-living artist, Guido Reni, had been insulted by rumors he thought were circulated by Cardinal Pamphili. 
When, a few years later, Pamphili was raised to the papacy, other Barberini relatives fled to France on embezzlement accusations. Despite this, the Capuchins held fast to their chapel altarpiece. Innocent was responsible for raising the Colegio de Santo Tomás de Nuestra Señora del Santísimo Rosario into the rank of a university. It is now the University of Santo Tomás in Manila, the oldest existing in Asia. In 1650, Innocent X celebrated a jubilee after 25 years of rule. He embellished Rome with inlaid floors and bas-relief in St. Peter's, erected Bernini. S. Fontana dei Quattro Fiumi in Piazza Navona, the Pamphili stronghold in Rome, and ordered the construction of Palazzo Nuovo at the Campidoglio. Innocent X is also the subject of Portrait of Innocent X, a famous painting by Diego Velázquez housed in the family gallery of Palazzo Doria Galleria Doria Pamphili. This portrait inspired the Screaming Pope paintings by 20th-century painter Francis Bacon, the most famous of which is Bacon. S. Study after Velázquez's portrait of Pope Innocent X. Innocent X died the 7th of January 1655, and at the conclave of 1655 was succeeded by Pope Alexander VII. Topic. See also. Topic. Cardinals created by Innocent X. Pamphili with Innocent X's family tree. Portrait of Innocent X Study after Velázquez's portrait of Pope Innocent X Topic. References Topic. Topic. Literature Topic. Guido Braun, Innocenz ex der Papst als Padre Commune in, Michael Matthäus, Lutz Klinkhammer eds, Eigenbit im Konflikt. Christensituationen des Papstums zwischen Gregor VII, und Benedikt XV. WBG, Darmstadt, 2009, pp. 119ff, ISBN 978-3-534-20936-1. Michael Tilly, 1990. Innocenz X. In Bots, Friedrich Wilhelm. Biographisch Bibliographisches Kirchenlexikon BBKL in German, 2. Ham, Botz, Calls. 1295-1298. ISBN 3-88309-032-8. Pope Innocent X CE Topic. External links Topic. Encyclopædia Britannica, 1911, Innocent X Chev. Artaud de Montour, 1911. The Lives and Times of the Popes Publications by or about Pope Innocent X at VD 17 Works by and about Pope Innocent X in the Deutsche Digital Bibliothek German Digital Library.